sorry about the noise, um, but good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Welcome back to my second channel. Today we're going to Ratchets. Um, I was on TikTok, we are having a really chill Sunday morning, thought we were just gonna stay in, be lazy, um, things like that. And this TikTok live came up of um, a guy who works at like these bulk warehouses that sell like food. So a lot of it has like gone past its best before and stuff, but like it's super cheap, you buy it by like the box and the crate. Um, and then we found out there's one in Bilston, which is only half an hour away. Um, so yeah, we decided that we're gonna go and have a little moochie moo. So yeah, we thought we'd just go and give it a bit of a look because I've never been to one of these bulk like warehouses before. So I thought it would just be a little bit fun and the weather is gorgeous. Lovely day to go out. Um, so yeah, let's go see what it's all about. Rogers. Oh. <laughs> it's huge. Yeah, beach. Jeez, monster espresso. Wow. Non-alcoholic vegan beer. Grapefruit lager. Grapefruit lager. Wow. <gasps> <laughs> it's open. I didn't know it was open. I, I Why is I. it open? I don't know. It sounds out of taste. Ew. Uh. <laughs> Does it smell like? I can smell it. I don't have to taste it. That's smell it? Hmm. Three mask. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How did that work out for you? <laughs> oh, if they were in <laughs> if they were in smaller cases, I'd give them a go. But I don't want six quid. Yeah, I don't want that many, and it's really horrible. <laughs> ketchup. It's a great price for ketchup. Best before September 2021. They'll last for ages. Hmm. So much tonic. Oh, and that's quick. It's oh, mine. What is this? Oh, yeah. What's this? <laughs> mustard. <laughs> Heinz mustard for a pound. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> that's great if you work in like a cafe or yeah. a burger stand. Yeah. Oh, the little pods. Are they pods. Yeah, they're pods. What, what yeah. Dad's I don't know if, what which one my dad has. These are for the Dolce Gusto. I spent five pound on a bag of coffee beans, yeah. which is say double the size of that. So I suppose it works out a lot better. Give the grind to a break. We got loads of coffee. I think all of this is coffee. Fair trade Italian. Morrison's. Yeah, would you take one of those to work? Yeah. Maybe. Instead of buying coffee out, save some money. Yeah? Just for a drink. Yeah? Yeah, I'll leave the ground. Yeah. Oh, these are. Oh, they're the pods. I obviously leave one open so you can have a look. A little vegan flat white pods.
Oh, he's found his sensation. Those ones you like, mango and. Wow! Well, get it. I mean, you're the one that eats them. Nice little snack with some hummus for you. Yeah, all of these are crisps. Nice. Just salt, ready salted. Yeah, jalapeno. <laughs> Just yeah. <laughs> Fuck this box. <laughs> Missing things. Ooh. Oh, clear chips. Three pounds a case. Oh, chip chop curry. I love my curry sauce, but oh no, I've tried them. <laughs> Do I take an aisle each? You found the good stuff. Oh. But you can't eat them all at one go. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Me? Uh, you that. I got it. Oh, perfect. Yeah, I should put it on the box. <laughs> I should follow you around. <laughs> Haven't filmed for a couple of aisles, it's quite the labyrinth, but we are getting some stock and it goes on and on and on forever. <laughs> Ta -ta sauce. Jesus, you'd have to have a lot of tartar sauce. Ooh, cans. Balsamic salad dressing. Mmm. <laughs> mm. Seriously, this place is just nuts. We've still got quite a few to go around. <laughs> so they got some things here that are free with any purchase, like baby food, which is really cool. Families can come and stuff. More baby food for free with any purchase. Awesome sauce. Nice. Why is that? That's cool. All right, so this is what 17 pound gets you. Let me show you. So we got 12 bags of these salt and vinegar crisps. They are the large bags though. Um, so they're pretty cool and they're gluten free, nice. Um, I picked up some veggie soup and it is Baxter's because I'm sick of paying over a pound for a tin of soup Like we do make our own soup, but sometimes you know when you're lazy and you're just like sod it I don't want to make soup. I just want something quick. So this and some like garlic bread. Oh, so good So I worked out to 50p a can This I'm so glad I found uh, this is some just plant-based bolognese These will be great for when I'm being super lazy with making my lunches I can just do some of this with some pasta or even just some toast or something like that and this was only a quid so it came out to 10p per sachet of the bolognese so I'm really happy with that because I picked up something similar which had less packs in and was more expensive so as soon as I saw that one I was like yes. Uh, we get through a lot of barbecue sauce in this house so we picked up this, I can't remember how much it was, like two, three, you, you would have seen it on the video, three pounds or something for that, four pounds, one, two, three, four, five, six, I think it's three pounds yeah because it works out at 50p each so and it's a really nice brand as well. Uh, Scott wanted to go for these, I'm down for some little iced coffees, uh, just some Americano Costa, we'll see if they're any good um, and I also picked up these, it was four for two pounds because my mom loves um, dark milk, Cadbury dark milk. So I picked those up for her, I don't think it was a good deal. But I'm sure she'll want to come next time because yeah, that worked out really well. Just wanted to give you an update. Um, sorry about the washing machine. These are dangerously delicious. Like, you know when I said it's a really big bag? Yeah, I can polish that off, I realized. Quite easily, absolutely amazing. Also, oof. I tried one of these yesterday with a little bit of spaghetti. Oh, you know what? Not too bad, not as good as my vegan bolognese, you know, but I don't expect that. But for 10p a sachet, that makes for such a quick lunch, 45 seconds, it's not bad. Throw it with some pasta and some cheese, I'm really happy for just those lazy lunches where you cannot be bothered. Or literally I'm gonna have that like on toast with some cheese or something. Um, because I'm lazy most days, I'm not gonna lie. For lunch, I'm lazy, so you know, I'm really glad I found those. <laughs> 
There were a lot of families there, and as I showed you, like they have like free stuff um, with any purchase. <clears throat> Even near the teals, I had like free salad dressings that would like help yourself to them, kind of thing. But we left them there. That was a lot of fun. If you go like once a month, maybe, and pick up stuff that you know, like for example, we get through a lot of barbecue sauce, it can really you know rack up the price. Um, eventually so that's great it's just like having the storage because the amount of like boxes full of like spaghetti pasta all that kind of stuff but they were huge but they were like four pounds for this huge box just full of like spaghetti and pasta shells and things like that so it worked out like stupid price per pack but it's just nowhere to put it and like i said if you're a big family it can work out really well for that as well um so yeah really happy if we did this like once a month or something and just stocked upon some like canned stuff um that'll be yeah i think that'll work out really well so i hope you enjoyed this from why so we did some research like because i knew best before does not like it's still safety it's just best before that day so i was like reading up on google and scar and i were like looking at that these best before august 21 so they've gone past their best before date but they're not the use by day use by day obviously is very strict normally even people go you know eat things way past their use by day but that's normally on things like you know perishables uh, fruit, veg, milk, uh, like dairy, fish, meat, things like that. Um, but this kind of stuff. And they also had things that weren't past their best buy day. I mean, this has just gone past it in December. I think they said on the live, there's five locations. They're all called the same. I think one's in Manchester, one's here, one near here. But if you just Google it, it'll like come up um, with all their locations. And yeah, you don't have to be a member. You just walk on in and take, you know, buy whatever you want. Um, so yeah, fantastic. Love it. Hope you enjoyed this little vlog. Um, I've always wanted to go to one of these places, so I'm glad there's one that's only like half an hour away. That's a lot. That's great. Uh, very happy. So I'm going to try and put these away, find somewhere to put them. Um, I've got plenty of space in that cupboard, so that'll help. And um, yeah, I'll love you and leave you. Thank you for joining me. Uh, let me know if you have something similar around yours. And is there anything else like this in like the Birmingham, like West Midlands area that I should check out? Because uh, I'm always one for a bargain. If it means buying in bulk for things that we use all the time, then it always just works out well. And I'm happy to find a place for it if it means I'm saving money later on. Um, so yeah, loving, leaving, shutting up. Uh, subscribe, like, comment, share. All the fun stuff. Do all of it, do none of it. It doesn't matter as long as you're happy. And I'll see you in the next one.